Hello viewers, thank you for joining us again in our channel. In today's question, I'm going to walk you through the process of obtaining the value of x in this exponential equation with ease. If this is your first time of seeing me on this space, I want you to sit back and watch this video. If you find value at the end of the day, please consider subscribing, okay? So with that being said, let us dive into this question right now. Alright viewers, the first thing I want you to note is that 36 can also be written as 6 to the power 2. So here I will write x to the x to the 3 is equal to 6 to the power 2. And the next thing I want to do is to take the power of 3 on both sides. So I'll have x to the x to the 3 all to the power 3 is equal to 6 to the power 2 all to the power 3. And remember one of the laws of exponent, it says if I have a to the power n all to the power n, I can write this guy as a to the power n all to the power n. As if to say you, you're swapping the, the position of the powers because you know multiplication is commutative, so you can actually swap the powers. Exactly what I'm going to do right here in this equation. So I'm going to swap the power of these guys like this. So I have x to the x. Okay, sorry, so I have x to the 3, then all x to the 3, okay? I just swap the power, okay? So I have this guy inside and this one outside. They're equal to, of course, 2 times 3 will give me 6 to the power 6. Now, this is what we want. Remember the condition that says if a to the power a is equal to b to the power b, then a must be equal to b. So you can see that this guy just like my a to itself is equal to this guy to itself. Then this guy must be equal to this guy. So then, let me take all these guys from here. So by this condition, it means that x to the power 3 must be equal to 6. Okay? Yeah, at this point, you want to find the value of x. So you take the power of 1 over 3 on both sides. So you have x to the power 3 all to the power 1 over 3 equal to 6 to the power 1 over 3. So that this 3, we can take away this 3. So x is equal to um, the cube root of 6. So we want, this is the solution to this problem. I believe it's so easy for us and for you watching. If it, if it does, please let me know in the comment section. And I want to see in our next video. Please subscribe. God bless you and bye.